If you've received federal stimulus money on behalf of someone who has died, the Internal Revenue Service wants that money back. The IRS used tax returns from the past two years to determine the eligibility for those payments, and some of the recipients have passed away between filing their taxes and receiving the stimulus money. It was previously thought that surviving family members might have been able to keep the money, but the IRS says it must be sent back. Money received through direct deposit can be sent back by check or by money order. Married couples who received a joint stimulus payment has to send back only the half intended for the person who is no longer alive. People who were in jail also have to return any stimulus money they might have received. More information on how to return the money is on the IRS website.